Hey, what's up everybody? Pokesum here, and in this video I have some more AEW cards. The first set, uh, this time I picked up two blaster boxes, um, because they are, uh, cheaper than going with hobby boxes. Uh, the hobby boxes, it, it's almost half the price, and I'm not sure why that is. I'm not sure if some of the rates are better in the hobby boxes. Um, I'm not sure if you can only get, a, you know, some kind of special insert in the hobby boxes. Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe it's because they're first edition and these are not. I don't know. Uh, but we will soon find out. Um, am I going to have to rip this? No. I'm not going to have to. Okay. Um, yeah. We will soon find out. <clears throat> I'm hoping these are first edition. I would like to, you know, complete the holes in my set, which there weren't a not, there, there's not a lot of holes as far as the main set goes. But I would like to fill all of those. <laughs> I will not make a joke. All right, so let's get into it. Um, do the packs look the same? I can't remember. And you know what? I have my hobby box right here. Okay, so no, even the packs look different. Hobby box. Okay, so you can clearly tell the difference between a hobby pack and a blaster box pack. Um, hmm. So let's see. Uh, you know, if, if these are not first edition, I might pick up a hobby box sometime in the future if they keep going down. They've only gone down $10 since I picked up my hobby box. So we shall see. All right, here we go. And let's see. Okay, no, these are first edition. So. I mean, I guess the only difference would be the pull rates. Um, let's find out. We have Penta. 42. Good. That's actually one of the ones I'm missing. I know I'm missing 40 through 46 and 11 through 17 and like 93 through 95. Like, I think 84, 85, 73, 77... 63, maybe. <clears throat> Not a whole lot of holes, but okay. Glad I got that one. We have Big Swole. Yep, that's evidently another one I'm missing. We have a gold um, parallel. I keep wanting to call them variants. Uh, don't know why. But we have a gold parallel of Private Party. We have a main features of Frankie Kazarian. And I'm not sure which main features I'm missing. It's several, you know. We have, oh, we have a gold. We have a gold parallel main features of Hangman Adam Page. That's pretty nice. Pretty, pretty, pretty nice. We have Arn Anderson, Dustin Rhodes, and Sting, AEW Magazine. Pretty sure I already had that one, yeah. Okay. Of course, we're we're hoping for an autograph. Um, and, but if not, uh, you know, maybe we can at least get another memorabilia card. Okay, we have Sting. That's actually one I was missing, I think. <laughs> we have Orange Cassidy, AEW Magazine. Matt Jackson, gold parallel of Christopher Christopher Daniels, which I think I already had. Uh, is this a dynamite parallel or a pyro parallel? Anyway, of Matt Jackson for AEW Magazine. Main features Ray Phoenix, Sean Spears, and Best Friends. All righty. Uh, 
Um, maybe hobby boxes are also higher because of... I think you're guaranteed two numbered cards per box. Maybe the rates are not as good in these blaster boxes, and that's why the price is so different. Dark Order. Gold Crip... <laughs> Crip? <laughs> Kip Sabian. Upper Deck Canvas Luchasaurus. All right, I did not have that one, so that's pretty cool. We have main features Santana. Chris Statlander, Cody Rhodes, and AEW Magazine, Kenny Omega. Pretty sure I already had that one, yeah. All right, we have The Butcher. Gold Parallel, uh, Orange Cassidy, AEW Magazine. I'm running out of places <laughs> Oh, hey, there's a memorabilia card. Okay. Santana. So, not the coolest, but, uh, and it's not numbered. So, it's just a regular old. Having been worn by the featured wrestler. Okay. So, there we go. It's, it's not numbered or anything, so not as cool as my first one. But... Hey, we got a memorabilia card, so that's good. But I think actually the memorabilia cards are, as far as the normal ones like this, they're much easier to get than, whoops, that's not the right kind of sleeve. Uh, much easier to get than the uh, uh, autographs. I want to say these are only like one per 14 or 16 packs, so it's not like super uncommon to get one of these. But still cool nonetheless, and we have Sting main features and Ortiz. And only five cards in that pack, I believe, yeah. Okay, it's okay. It's all right, folks. We can still get an autograph. These are not... I mean, I don't believe these are set like Pokemon booster boxes are set. We have Matt Hardy, AW Magazine, Matt Hardy, Gold Parallel, Chris Jericho, a Pyro Parallel or Dynamite Parallel, whatever you want to call it, of the Blade. We have Top Rope, Nick Jackson. Pretty cool one to get. Top rope, Nick Jackson. Matt Jackson, Justin Roberts, and Anna J. And I've got a lot of piles here in front of me. <laughs> all right, all right. All right, we have Alex Reynolds. Trent. Paul Turner. Gold Parallel, Brandy Rhodes. Matt Jackson, Main Features. Rhodes to Success, and it's gold. Uh, the, all the other ones I got were silver. So a Gold Parallel of Rhodes to Success. Or as far as I know it is. And I did not have that one, so... That's doubly, doubly good. <laughs> doubly good. Uh, Moxley, AW Magazine, and Frankie Kazarian. And I need to remember to look for um, oh, what you call it? Finisher and call out. I don't, I don't even know what they're called. Chuck Taylor, Lance Archer. I love Aunt Lance Orcher. Wish he was utilized a little better, but you know. Gold parallel, Tony Skivone. Hey, Jake Roberts, Pyro Parallel. Very nice. Where'd where'd my other Pyro? Or is that dynamite? You know, I don't even know. Chris Jericho main features. Why are all the main features turned the opposite way? Jurassic Express. Ricky Starks and Riho. 
And I realized I've still yet to get Kenny Omega's normal card. That's crazy. <laughs> All right. We have in our last pack of our first blaster, Darby Allen, Lucha Brothers, Stu Grayson, Santana Gold Parallel, Upper Deck Canvas, Nyla Rose. I had some, was it a top rope insert? I don't think I had her Upper Deck Canvas. No, I think it was something else. Scorpio Sky, nine features, Hikaru Shida, and Mark Queen. All right, so one blaster down, one to go. Get these packs out of the way. complete like the main normal set um, like I said I'll be picking up more we've yet to get a numbered card so maybe that is one of the benefits of getting a um, hobby box all right here we go Final eight packs for now. Really like an autograph. Let's see what we can get. We have Christopher Daniels, Kip Sabian, Gold Ortiz, Top Rope Darby Allen, a gold top rope of pack. Two top ropes in the same pack. That's crazy. Still not numbered though. Just a gold parallel of top rope. I, I don't know how rare those are. Maybe I should look that up, huh? Jim Ross, Abaddon, and Darby Allen Magazine. You know, I could look that up. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. I'm just curious. Uh, where's top rope on here? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, the Roads to Success Gold Parallel is one for 40. Okay, Top Rope Gold Parallel, one for 40. So I've got two uh, one for 40s. I'd like to get a Wednesday in action. I didn't get one in the Hobby Box. I thought Hobby Boxes, for some reason I was thinking they were 36 packs. And I was thinking, man, I'm getting these for a good price. And then I got them in and it was 16 packs. And I was like, oh, crap. That's high. Okay, we have MJF Magazine, Pinta, Big Swole, Gold, Matt Jackson, whoopsie, there's a one of those parallels of Penelope Ford, main features, Brandy Rhodes, Pack, and Inner Circle. It's, they should have their... Why are they called inner circle? It's not the whole inner circle. Okay. All right. We have Sting, Orange Cassidy, Gold, and Justin Roberts, Upper Deck Canvas of Jungle Boy. Where's my Upper Deck Canvas? Oh, there they are. Main features, Orange Cassidy. Nick Jackson, Jake Hager, Colt Cabana Magazine. Lordy, lordy, lordy. All right, Matt Jackson Magazine. Ty Conti, Dark Order, Gold Anna J. Uh, thing, a big, big, what do you... <laughs> Um, anyway, one of these parallels of Lance Archer. Main features of Nyla Rose. John Silver, The Blade. Only four packs left, guys. 
I know I'm still missing several of my <coughs> regular cards. Matt Hardy, magazine Matt Hardy, Alex Reynolds, Gold Frankie Kazarian, Roads to Success. First match on Dynamite. Huh, that's... Okay, that's not one of the ones that I had. Where's my Roads to... Oh, I only had one Roads to Success so far. <clears throat> and it was that gold one. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> uh, here we go. Gold main features of Cody Rhodes. So, two... Hey, there we go. Anyway, uh, two one per 40s. In just 16 packs. That's that's cool. Kenny Omega's normal card. Thank God. And AEW Magazine Cody Rhodes, which is one of the ones I was missing. Glad I finally got Kenny. All right, three packs to go. Come on, I'd really like something special in this blaster box. All right, we have Trent, Paul Turner, Gold Parallel Jurassic Express. Old uh, Silver Pyro E. Arn Anderson. Main features Luchasaurus. Sammy Guerrero. FTR. And Isaiah Cassidy. Getting down to the nitty gritty here, folks. Are we going to get anything good in this one or not? Hey, there's another one I was missing. I was missing 84, I'm pretty sure. All right, we have Chuck Taylor, Lance Archer, Darby Allen, Gold, Ricky Starks, Upper Deck Canvas, The Butcher and the Blade. Main features, Jake Hager, John Moxley. I'm not going to try to do the voice, and I was missing that one. And Magazine, Chris Jericho. All right, well, this is the last pack we have for now. Will it contain something good? Yes, it will. <laughs> oh, talk about some last pack magic. Oh, boy. All right. Yep, I think I see something good. A thick card. We have the Butcher. Gold Parallel Moxley. And it's Abaddon. Uh well, <laughs> and it's not numbered, but it is still, still a memorabilia card, so can't complain there. I got two memorabilia cards, so I mean, that's good. Main features Darby Allen and Jake Roberts. Okay, so. How was our haul overall? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, nothing great, but I did, didn't did get an autograph once again. But I did get two memorabilia cards, so that's... Um, memorabilia parallel. One per 14, so... Okay, the, the thing about these, I can give a review now if you like, because I open the same amount of retail packs as I have hobby packs. Hobby packs, uh, yeah, they're higher if the price comes down a little more. I definitely go that way. Um, I spent 50 a piece on these, so $100 for 16 packs. Right now, you can get hobby boxes for $180. Um, I think 150 would be a much better price, um, but that's just me. Yeah, if they ever come down to there, to there, I mean, which they will, if these places want to sell them. Uh, yeah, because you, you, you do get, you're guaranteed two numbered parallels in a hobby box. So yes, that I do understand. Hey, Lola. I do understand why they are higher. Okay, so let's go over our pulls. I uh, don't really need to go through the magazines, I don't think. They're just part of the main set. 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 regular main features. How many gold, regular gold parallels? One, well, one of a tag team. Three, that's a special dude. They're supposed to be harder to get. I think she's classified as a, yeah, a wrestler. Not as a special, whatchamacallit. Okay, so we got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Regular gold parallels, two tag teams, two, uh, whatever they call them, you know. So that's 14 total right there. And we got two gold parallels of magazine. So 16. 16 total. And. <coughs> <clears throat> Let's see, where to go next? Uh, heck if I know. <laughs> okay, we got four canvas cards. So, yeah, that's right on average. These are, well, these are one every four or five packs. I think actually every five, maybe? Not sure. But anyway, we got four canvas cards there. And we got... How rare are the gold main features? I'm not sure I even see anything about main features. Maybe I'm overlooking it. Oh wow, base set AEW magazine. Gold Parallel is one for five. We only got two of those. Hmm. Pyro Parallel, which would be this, I believe, one for 16. So that's a Pyro Parallel of Matt Jackson. Or is it a Dynamite? Heck if I know. What's an Upper Deck Canvas SP? Okay, main features, regular one for two. We got like 13 of them. Gold parallel, oh, just one for five. So, yeah, we go here. <clears throat> two gold parallels, they're not as rare as I thought they were. Adam Page and Cody Rhodes. This one is either, I'm almost done, Lola. One for 16 or one per 54. I mean, I, I don't know, I'd call that a... I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I was going to say 54, but I don't know. We got one regular Roads to Success and one Gold, which is one for 40. Two regular Top Rope, Darby Allen and Nick Jackson. And one Gold one of Pac. Pack. Uh, these Parallels, which... Are these Pyro or... Uh, one, two... Three, four, five of these. And then, of course, we got the two memorabilia cards. Abaddon and Santana. And we got no numbered cards. So that's definitely a minus. These are cheaper, but you're much less likely to get numbered cards. Um, which I know you can't say, well... These 16 were taken off the press in a row, but <clears throat> I didn't get one in either one, so. So, yeah. Who knows? Somebody could buy two of these blaster boxes and get one in each one. You never can tell, you know. Um, but still, if they were the same odds as a hobby box, you would get one numbered card in each of these, and you don't. So that's, that's probably the main reason these are cheaper. Um, so anyway, that's that. Uh, yeah, I'll probably, like I said, if I pick up any more of these, um, probably go for the uh, hobby boxes. Especially if they come down. 
All right, well, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, do all that if you want. Uh, be excellent to yourselves, dudes. Have a good one.